Hello and welcome back to Stronghold. And today we'll be doing episode episode level six, the Rat's Proposal, which is part of Act Two. So we finished the first act. It's pretty good. You damned fool! What in God's name did you think you were doing? Well, to be fair, it was I who gave the order to scout further. Yes, 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 but not even you would be stupid enough to authorize an all-out attack on Depus. Meanwhile, the rat receives news of the loss of his county. I can't believe it! My troops! They've scattered all over the place! There's nothing I can do! I've lost the county! Show some backbone! My contingency plan is already in motion. You'll have your county back soon enough. Trust me. Trust me. You don't sound very trustworthy. Later, a dispatch arrives from the Wrath, stating your newly acquired county has been blockaded. Oh, no. As Woolsack reads the letter, you and Sir Longarm look on like a pair of naughty schoolchildren. Hmm. Mission 6, the Rat's Proposal. De Poos is willing to consider a truce once we withdraw our troops from his county. Ah, it's a trap! This youngster's father was killed the same way. We should use our momentum for another strike. No, 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 we don't have the manpower to sustain a full-scale war. You are dismissed, leaving the Lords to discuss the important details of your next mission. Finally, a red-faced Sir Longarm storms out of the room to give you your briefing. Lord Wolsack, in all his wisdom, wishes you to arrange a truce, but I don't like it. I will lend you my finest mason, so you can prepare yourself for the worst. Pitch a small camp in an open clearing, then await Duke de Pousse's arrival. Do not bring arms to bear upon him for any reason. To secure our lands, these talks must succeed. Now, before I start, you'll probably notice, hey, the difficulty is back on very hard. What the hell? Well, after much thought of the previous one and how, when I did that correctly, how easy it was, I could easily imagine myself completing that on very hard it was just a matter of doing it correctly so from now on I'm going to think a little bit harder about those little details for example the proper placement of my Fletchers and hopefully that makes a difference in whether or not I succeed in these things Duke de Poos wishes to meet us in this valley surrounded by cliffs as it looks like someone has it's a trap Sir Longarm was right <gasps> Let's... I can't even do anything here. Let's continue walking as we're getting shot at. Walk into the position... Walk to where everybody can shoot at us, and then completely fail at hitting anybody. Who the hell were you guys aiming at? A trap! Our advance party was mown down like animals! Now, I will give you some new orders. Build a large fortification and prepare your troops for Duke de Pousse's arrival. Use the masons I sent with you to quarry stone and build a strong and permanent castle here. Okay. So of course it was a trap. Where was Admiral Place a Akbar when to you needed him? Castle, my liege. Sight your granary, sire. I think the granary, since we're kind of boxed in, will go over here. And as you can see, we can no longer make wooden walls. We can no longer make a wooden barracks. We have to make it out of stone. What does that mean for us? Well... Actually, now that I bloody think about it, I should probably pitch myself over here for the wood, but I'm going to take a risk and continue on with it. Let's put three of those guys, because we don't need wood as bad this time. Let's get, well, another one of these, and a second house. Now, as you can also see, we get all three kinds of food this time, so we could easily focus on 
one or two kinds of food. However, be prefer preferable to get all three because that gives you an additional bonus. Because it gives you a multi-food bonus, which means you get additional happiness, which means you can tax your people more. Now, what does it mean that we can only make things out of stone? Well, that means we need to spend a lot of people on quarries. Now, what do I mean by a lot of people? Well, three people have to man that. One picks the pieces up with that little winch. Another one lets it out of the winch to fall down where that rock is. And the third guy chips it. We also need an ox tether, which is a guy who loads those cut pieces of stone onto an ox and ships it over here. Quite a large investment, considering that is half of a hovel. Now, we have 75 stone to start off with. We can make a small gate. We are going to make a small gate. Let's make it here. We cannot make any towers as of yet, which is kind of annoying, but we'll deal. Let's build that, and we have a starter of eight bowmen, which leads me to believe we are probably going to die. Now, one thing to note, most importantly, is that since these are stone walls, we also need to create crenellations. I will not create a crenellation yet, because I want to finish the wall. But, that basically means that in order, in order for our men to have any protection on the wall, they need to have crenellations in front of them. I don't think I'll actually put them down just yet, but I will put them down shortly. Now you see how that guy picks those rocks up and puts them to the ox tether? Once there is enough to load it onto the ox, he will bring it over here and we'll have all of those stone. It's like... Eight, I believe? Oh, we have a lot of extra people. I should probably have gotten more wood choppers, but we have wood. So I think I'll actually get a fourth wood chopper because we're probably... Our luck is we're probably going to severely need him. Now there's one thing of note that I specifically remember quite vividly of, of my past failures. We're going to thicken the wall eventually, so let's do that. And I remember this from playing this game that if that... Now normally your man can walk up the gatehouse to get onto the wall. But if the gatehouse is closed, they can't do that, so you require a staircase. Otherwise, once the gates are closed, you can't put more men on there, which means if your men happen to be off the wall when the gate automatically closes because there's enemy close enough, you're kind of screwed. You can open it again, but normally by the time it closes, you don't have time for that. So, let's continue this wall. It's actually blanking. Wow, it's blanking out that far away. That's not going to be too good. It's blanking out because that is too far away from the castle in order to build. I am going to build this. Wrong direction. Build this right. Dang it. Build this right here. So that way my men have the my wood choppers have the ability to get out and chop wood when it's in peacetime. There. Have a wall going up that and we will have a have the wall go all the way to the edge. Yeah, that'll do. So that way the enemy cannot walk in. Eventually, we'll get this wall, hopefully, all the way to the gatehouse, and we'll have a crenellation in front. But for now, we need to make a mill, because we have wheat coming in now. Our food is actually dwindling, food because stocks we are dwindling, only... my liege. I copied his words. Because we were only given some meat to start off with, which meat obviously goes faster than bread. 
And I believe cheese goes even faster because it's... Or maybe it's even? I don't actually know the statistics on that, so don't quote me on it. But regardless, considering you only get three pieces of cheese from cows, that's kind of a large investment. And now, most importantly, we need to get get at least one of these guys working right now. And next, we need a barracks, because there's no telling when they're going to attack. Actually, let's look at the timer. That does look kind of close. Hopefully, building this guy this late wasn't a death sentence. It probably will be, with my luck. And how did these guys get up there? I, I saw... Or maybe those are those guys, and those guys have been here, in here the entire time. I have no idea. But we should have plenty of... Oh, wow, there's a signpost over here. Huh, that changes things. I just realized there's a signpost over there. Since there's a signpost over there, the enemy have the ability to spawn over there, which isn't too good. <laughs> I didn't prepare or expect that. These guys are close enough. I was worried about that for a second, but... Eh. Okay, so now... We need... One... Two bakeries. That'll do for now. Can build at least one more guy before we need another hovel. Which is good. What we need is more stone. We're probably going to need to make another hovel to get a, to get a second quarry, because... There ain't no way we're having our wall be built by one quarry. And one quarry fu fuels one ox teller. So. But, before we start on building the wall, we severely need this. We await orders! Needed, sir. Our food stocks are dwindling. And My once liege. we get the bread production going, like as soon as we start to have bread in our granary, I will up the rations our food to double so that way I can start taxing to pay we for these orders. Needed, sire. Which would be good. Now, let's just... Oh, I can't. There's only one piece. Because I'm worried about my, my luck, as they'd be able to walk up that for some particular reason. Ooh. Probably making somebody dizzy. But I had to get it into the right direction. Because, for some reason, I... there are deer on our wall. The deer are on our wall. <laughs> what the hell? Why are the deer on our wall? I feel like I'm in a post-apocalyptic place. Just deer everywhere. <laughs> well, that just happened. Wood needed. Oy. We await Recruits orders. Needed, sire. All right, I only have one guy. Our cows are struck down by a <gasps> strange malady, my lord. Well, no more cheese for a while. Our food stocks are dwindling, my See, liege. See, three types. <coughs> Bessie, no. Three types of food eaten gives plus two happiness. So the if I look at this, worship, I can. Losing. A little if I have food stocks are three, dwindling, which my liege. I won't have it for much longer because of the, that, but it doesn't really matter. I'll just keep the tax as it is. Two types of food eaten plus one. I'll keep the taxes as it, wa as it is until it gets to 75-ish. So that way we can keep safe. Let's put you over here. Because I don't want to block that... Walkway. We await orders. Oh yeah, do I have? I need to make another hovel because I'm stupid. Because that guy should become a baker any second now. Maybe. Yeah, there we go. So second hovel right here. Our food stocks are dwindling, my liege. Let's put it on extra no rations in the and a bit lord. of extra tax. The people love you, my lord. We await orders. Needed, sire. And then recruit some more archers. 
And then next thing we'll do with our wood is get another Fletcher. And then we'll worry about the second quarry. We await Recruits orders. needed, sire. Recruits needed, sire. We just need the... Which I... We need wood, which I just heard a bunch of wood get dropped. So, let's place that there. Let's leave a hole in there just in case he, like, has to walk around the entire thing, which would be annoying. And we now have all of our arrows, which is a whopping 11, ready to go. Kind of worried about this timer, because that timer is pretty far down, and we still have yet to see anything. So let's at least get crenellated wall where it counts, which is right there. We await orders. As my men get on the Moving wall off. and apparently want to stand on the crenellations. Actually, we let's put them on the way. gate for now. See, some of them are going directly in the gate, others are using the stairs. And if the gate was closed, yada yada, I already said that. I always did like it how you could use the edge of the map as a wall. <laughs> that really does help a lot. We await orders! Even if it's yes? completely cheap. Leaving now! You'll probably see most of see most of my castles be produced like that, because I just find it easier and safer. I mean, if I know eventually I'll get to a point where I can't, and then I'll just roll with it, but until then, I'll do it like this. Now what we need is more wood for a second quarry. Here we go. I'm kind of curious if this one ox tether can hold it. If these guys start to build up stone, I'll build a second ox tether, but for now, I'll leave it as is. And I want a third hunter's post because we're running low on meat, and I know we're going to be running low on cheese, and I'm probably going to build a second dairy farm. Actually, I'll save wood for a another um, Fletcher's, because Fletcher's are bloody important. We await orders. As you would guess, Archers from how ready. many I actually needed to survive the previous level. And again, we haven't heard high nor hair. Of the rat. So that worries me greatly. Because <laughs> I don't want him to suddenly appear with 40 archers and 5 catapults on my wall. Which I think is probably what's going to happen is that it's a build up as much as we you possibly can orders. mission and hope you my live the final yours. attack. Because so far we're halfway through the game. And we haven't gotten anything. <laughs> this is really a ramshackle castle, not since we have a family of deer in here. Family? I'm not sure what to call them properly. Nope, oh, more wood. Do we have enough? We do not. Uh, we got that guy cutting wood. And this a one's almost from the done. Rats. Uh -oh. oh, about to retreat, are we? Well, it's no use groveling now. Who said I was going to retreat? So that's one ox tether so close to the stockpile seems to be working just fine right now. I'm probably gonna need one a bit later, but yeah. Oh, right. I can't actually put crenellations there because of the way the wall, it, how close the bloody wall is. So let's do this. It's going to look kind of awkward, and I hate that, but it'll do for now. And I can't, I'll just do this. So much for a piece of stone, get yeah. We await orders! Get more guys. Lord? Get them on Moving top. Off. And another Fletcher's. I'm thinking... The rat's troops are attacking. That apparently we're under attack. Those are laddermen. And siege engineers. If the laddermen manage to get on the wall, we're screwed. Because 
fun little fact, the only unit that can actually knock down ladders once they're put up is the spearmen. We cannot build spearmen, therefore if they get a wall up, we cannot actually knock it or if they get a ladder up on our wall, we cannot actually knock it down, which would obviously be a bit annoying. They are building a single catapult? No, there's another building right there. So they're building two catapults. Or should do, anyway. Those are an awful lot of laddermen. Holy crap, they're shooting from a distance. But they don't have a lot of archers, which is good, because that means these archers are going to die. And my men see archers as a bigger threat than yes. those guys. Well, at least they die easily. Archers, binder, my toy is yours. Steady arrows, ready. Oh, I can actually Launch. shoot them here. Ladders will break. Target. Shoot them. Archers, shoot them all. Ready. My boy is yours. Not Don't arrows. let them on the wall. There we go. You can't get on the wall now, sucker. So now we've pretty much won. What happened to the catapult? Oh, for some reason they moved their catapults around. And I kind of, kind of curious as to what they have those three extra guys here for. So, that was a good start, I'd say. All Our things considered. Are struck down by a strange and malady, Bessie's dead again. Yes, I would say that's a good start. Why? Because we have loud cows. We are on our that and they also moved my men. We await target. Shoot that thing. See how many arrows a catapult takes? Which it makes sense, but... Yes? Come on, kill the... Whoa. Well, that thing's almost dead, too. Apparently they were shooting that one first. So now we just gonna kill those guys, and then we're all we set. Archers on ready. Yay! What did we get while we were gone? Another Fletcher's. That's what we got. So we got a bit of structural damage, as half of the wall is gone. So let's hit repair. It only costs two, which is good. It's actually going to cost more to repair this wall than it's going to take to actually repair the gatehouse itself. Let's do that. My boy is yours. Get all these guys up here. Be Lord. You. Instructions. We await orders. Can't get there, Lord. Can't get there, Lord. Well, that's rather annoying. He seems to be flying villagers have seen a band of the rats' troops heading this way. Well, he's the first to die next time. At least I got that thing to be repaired. Okay, so... The rat is apparently sending in... in his next wave already. We await orders. Needed, However, sir. we archers have a steady supply ready. of archers. Now, since they had catapults, the first wave... They're probably going to have... Whoa! We definitely need a second ox tether. Okay, one of those guys should go to the we ox tether. We have so much bread. Sire. Since we have so much bread, let's build another hovel and build another woodcutter. Because we have a lot of extra food, we can supply such a thing. Which the is good. Rats troops are attacking. He's already attacking again. Dang, My they really don't yours. give you we await orders. any leeway in Me lord? this. Alright, get no. up there. You guys are going to be on ladder duty if they send ladders over there. I see about as many ladders as last time. Actually, they kind of look like it's the same exact degree of attack, which is good, mind you. You guys are going to be on ladder duty over there. Now they're making four catapults. 
four catapults are probably going to destroy our wall completely. So let's just double that up, since that's probably going to be the section they're shooting at. Those are definitely more archers than last time. Where did all those ladder-men come from? They're probably not on the screen yet. Alright. Instructions! Shoot. Take steady aim! We await orders! Shoot. Arrows ready, yes? You guys shoot. Notch arrows! Archers shoot. ready! Shoot Find them all targets. of the targets! Shoot My all of the yours. ladders. Take steady aim! My lord, arrows ready! Instructions! Notch. There's so many ladders! Find them targets! Yes? Take steady aim! Archers ready! There's like 50 him, ladders over there. What the bloody? Orders. My boy is yours. Moving off. Get over there and knock those ladders down. Or shoot we the guys. Are on our way. Okay, we that's not good. Orders. Arrows. Shoot. Ready. Arrows. Find shoot. them targets. Yes. Take steady aim. Arrows ready. Archers not ready. Arrows. My boy is yours. Find and target! Okay, okay, shoot that guy. Aim. The Lord. Holy crap. Arrows ready! Yeah, knock it down. Instructions! Notch! Arrows! We await uh, orders! Time to go! <laughs> yes? <laughs> Archers ready! I Even have no words now. for this insanity. Except that apparently we My won. Boy is yours. That, what, that just happened. Oh, the gatehouse that had all of our archers on it had 68 exper 68 hit points left. If that thing got hit Lord? one more time, we wouldn't have had a gatehouse. <laughs> wow. And that thing really did save our bacon. Because otherwise they would have knocked a hole right through that wall. Though, not enough. However, we do have four more of those. How much wood do we have? We have enough for another. I'm just gonna spam these things because we don't really have another have any other sort of choice. Get another one of these. Hopefully we don't run out. My luck is we will. Outlying villages and seen another a band attack of the troops is heading coming. This way. Like I said, this thing don't give you any leeway. Let's get a second staircase and more crenellations. Oop, I did not fix these. And some more crenellations. And that'll work. Now what we need to do is get a bit more wall for these got for my archers to stand. We await on. orders! We await orders! We're actually running out of flour for our bread. That's not too good. We await orders! Because this guy is currently at harvesting season, so that is why. But we have plenty of bread in storage, so I'm not severely worried. Whoa, they even hit this one, apparently. Which, I need one piece of stone. Oh, that's pr that next attack might be the last one for the level? I'm not quite sure. I don't think it would be. The rat's troops are attacking. It is not, and he's coming from that direction. Holy yes. crap, we do not have Moving off. proper crenellations on that side. However, we can shoot them almost immediately. Archers ready! Oh, if we My if we take yours. out those guys because they're not red because they're the AI is too stupid, I would be so happy. Me lord, can't target him, sir. Oh. Instructions, can't target him, sir. That sucks. Cute. We could kill a couple of them, but let's repair this and crenellate the wall real quick. Like. Okay. I'm not sure why I crenellated the wall when they knew Weapons full we well they were going to be shooting it directly we after, but... Yes. 
Uh, really, I think our main now. goal is to just kill all of these guys. Archers uh, ready. Like the laddermen, we don't need to worry that much about. My boys, you're but we'll just make sure they don't have any in. ladders on us. Instructions. Like directly on our guys. We await our orders. orders. Yes. Ready. Not arrows. They have so arrows. many ladders. Ready. I'm glad they breached the wall because now they're not going to use the ladders. <laughs> That's one thing the AI doesn't have going for it. They have so many laddermen they can cover the entirety of our wall. Okay, we pretty much killed their archer force. Now we just need to worry about their spearmen who are walking basically into a killing pit. However, they're going for straight for the Lord, and my people aren't not smart arrow. enough to we shoot, them, shoot at those guys. Yes. Ah. Take steady aim. Uh, uh, I can't move him. Archers, ready. Target him, sir. Boys, Holy crap. Um, they kind of win by default because they targeted arrow. the king. The Lord? Find wow. The Batty wins again! Batty wins again! <laughs> wow. They charged for him. You have been defeated. <sighs> well, at least now we know what we're up against. And we know that the third wave is going to come from a different direction. And we need to focus more on getting our quarries up as soon as possible to get as much stone as possible to hold off those. <laughs> so now that we know what we're up against, the next le the next time we try this should be just a little bit easier. And until next time, I'll see you then. God, that guy's so ugly. <laughs>